so we are talking about principal agent game now so there is a principal let's say there is an employer and there is an agent who is a worker let's say i am an employer and you guys are uh, a worker and i cannot observe your effort i can only observe the result which you produce right i can only observe whether the project is successful or not i cannot observe how much of effort you are putting right so it's like a moral hazard problem so there is a principle so let's write uh, the initial conditions there is a principle of uh, employer that is an employer this is an agent is an employee alan is an agent and it is a moral hazard kinds of kind of problem so alan's effort is not directly observable effort are not directly <clears throat> observable only the outcome is seen so pat is uh, an employer who wants to keep uh, or who, or who wants to hire uh, uh, alan because uh, he wants alan to work on a new software product so if alan uh, is going to accept an offer so pat is going to give an offer to alan and if alan is going to accept the offer then alan has two choices to put high effort or to put low effort right uh, alan has two choices he can pick up either high effort or low effort right and if the project is successful right um revenue is going to be 6 and the cost of an effort is also there okay i'll i'll write about the cost later um and in case the project is unsuccessful the revenue is just 2 right well whether the project is successful or not it depends upon the is effort level plus random factors or nature so you don't know because sometimes even with high effort the project can be in success that is also possible so when there is high effort there is low effort and the probability of success so probability of success is half in case if there is high effort if there is low effort then the probability of success is always zero it is always going to fail if you are going to put low effort right then there is a cost of an effort cost of high effort is 1 basically minus 1 disutility that is the cost so you can write it as minus 1 also if you want uh, and uh, cost of low effort is 0 cost of low effort is 0 alan um alan is risk averse
right? His utility function is x to the power alpha. And uh, principal is risk neutral. His utility function is just x. So there is a contract design. So what kind of contract Pat has to set up so that he accepts, Ellen is going to accept it. So so Pat is going to offer wage W and bonus B only this bonus is going to be paid only if the outcome is successful. Bonus will not be paid if the outcome is not successful. Right. Uh, so you can write somewhere. Wage is paid regardless. Bonus is paid only if success. So Ellen then chooses. So Ellen has a choice of to accept or to decline that is or not accept. So accept or decline. So I'll just write it. Not accept or decline, you can say. So, and Ellen also, in case if he accepts, Then also Ellen has two choices. To put high effort or to put low effort. Right. So in case if he's going to put high effort, then nature moves. Because then also project can be successful with only probability half. And it can still be unsuccessful. And if he is going to put low effort, then it is project is always going to fail. Always. You with me? So nature moves ka matlab hai that there can be success or failure. There can be success, there can be failure. Now, how do you put this in uh, terms of a diagram? So at the beginning of the game, Pat is going to move and uh, Pat is uh, this is the information set for the Pat, right? Pat offers wage W and bonus B. Now he doesn't know whether uh, Ellen is going to put high effort or low effort. So if Ellen is going to accept the offer, so when you say accept, it is yes. Not accept, it is no. So if Ellen is going to accept the offer, yes. Or Ellen can reject the offer, decline the offer. No. So he has not accepted the offer. If Ellen is not going to accept the offer, then the payoffs are 0, 0. While if Ellen is going to accept the offer, then again, Ellen has choice between putting high effort or low effort. Again, Ellen is going to come. The moment Ellen has accepted the offer, then again, Ellen is going to come high effort and low effort. So if he puts in low effort, then what are the payoff for, for Pat? Low effort, revenue is going to be just two, right? Wage has to be paid regardless. Utility function is X. Yeah, yeah, utility function. So what will happen? Revenue minus this guy. Wage for Pat. For uh, this guy, your... Uh, uh, Ln it is going to be x to the power alpha. Basically, um, 
your uh, your uh, wage minus uh, effort cost to the power alpha ab uh, when you are putting low effort there is no effort cost so it will be w minus 0 to the power alpha or w to the power alpha when you put up high effort then what happens right then nature comes just see how nature is being shown this is the way nature is moving here and nature can make the project successful or unsuccessful so it can make project unsuccessful with probability half or it can make project successful with probability half you with me and in that in that case what happens there is uh if it is unsuccessful what is the payoff for uh, for a for for pat 2 minus w what is the payoff for this guy uh ln he is getting w plus 0 to the power alpha he is getting wage but he is not getting any bonus so w plus 0 to the power alpha minus effort cost which is this i hope it is clear right and what about this guy if the project is successful how much is the revenue 6 how much wage has to be given w how much bonus has to be given b beta bonus for i mean bonus will be given out of the revenue only so for pat bonus is deducted for ln bonus is added and what about this guy how much uh, ln is going to get w plus bonus b to the power alpha minus 1 because he is put in the effort as you know now for ln utility function is this so how much money he is getting this is what x is so he will be getting w plus b to the power alpha na so right wage and bonus so in case if it is unsuccessful there is no bonus if it is successful this is like this so here also when it is uh, and for for pat it is just this the money which he has this this much right so this is the way you draw this game right this is the way you draw this game <clears throat> you with me right okay we'll stop here and we'll take the discussion further in the next class i hope it was useful to you thank you beta